the least positive integer n such that 2i upon 1 plus i whole to the power of n is a positive integer. So let us consider 2i upon 1 plus i which equals to 2i into 1 upon 1 plus i and since we know that 1 upon z is equal to z bar upon mod z whole square so if z is equal to 1 plus i z bar is equal to 1 minus i it's conjugate and mod z is equal to root over 1 plus 1 which is equal to root 2 so mod z square we can write root 2 whole square is 2 so we can write this as 2i into 1 minus i upon mod z whole square is 2 so which is equal to i times of 1 minus i which is equal to i minus i square which is equal to i plus 1 since i square is equal to minus 1. So we got 2i upon 1 plus i is equal to i plus 1 and we required a least positive integer in such that 2i upon 1 plus i whole to the power of n must be a positive integer. So that is y, 1 plus i whole to the power of n must be a positive integer. So let us select from the options n is equal to 2. So we have 1 plus i whole to the power of 2 which is equal to 1 plus i square plus 2i which is equal to 1 minus 1 plus 2i is equal to 2i which is not an integer. It's an imaginary number. And now let us consider n is equal to 4. That is 1 plus i whole to the power of 4 which is equal to 1 plus i whole square whole square we can write which is plus 2i whole square that is a 4 into i square that is 4 into minus 1 which is equal to minus 4. So minus 4 is a negative integer so it's not a positive integer. Now let us move to the next number n is equal to 8. So we have 1 plus i whole to the power of 8 which is equal to 1 plus i whole to the power of 4. 1 plus i whole to the power of 4 whole square which is equal to minus 4 whole square which is equal to 16 and it is a positive positive integer. 16 belongs to positive integer and hence we can say that for n is equal to 8 is the smallest the least positive integer such that 2i upon 1 plus i whole power 8 is a positive integer 16. Okay so option b is the answer. Please like share subscribe and support us. Thank you.